Hey guys, RTT back here for that video. Guys, today I'm going to teach you guys how to get iMessage on your Galaxy Fold 3. Now, this will require you having a Mac of some kind, whether it is a MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, iMac, Mac Mini, Mac Pro, whatever is the case, you do need to go ahead and have a Mac in order to do this and get iMessage on your Galaxy Fold 3. Once you do go and have an iMac it's of some kind or a Mac of some kind, let's go ahead and talk about it, guys. All right, so now that you are on Mac, what you're going to go ahead and do is go to two different websites. We have noip.com and we have dynew.com. Now, both these websites, you're going to create your own DNS server. It's very easy and simple. All you do is follow the instructions. Once you go and create your account, you're going to go to servers. You're going to go and create server. You can do that on, like I said, both of these services. Now, the reason why we're doing both services is because this dynew is when you're on Wi-Fi that's when you're going to be getting your iMessages. When you use no IP, that's going to be giving you for, for, uh, 5G or LTE messages, iMessages, when you're on 5G or LTE. So whether you're on Wi-Fi or data, you're always going to be getting your messages. That's why we're running two DNS servers for that exact reason. So once you go ahead and deal with that, you, belt, you go ahead and set up a server on both of these services. Uh, again, it's absolutely free, does not cost you money. Uh, and you, of course, do have your... Um, next thing you're going to do is go to the downloads uh, for both of these. So for example, right here says the client downloads. Download the client for Mac for the no, uh, dynu.com and then also download the update client for no IP. Download both of those clients, set up your servers. Now we're going to go ahead and get into the next thing. The next thing is going to go and be going to airmessage.org. That's going to go ahead and let you be able to download and install the actual air message app on your Mac that we're going to go and be, you know, actually transmitting data to, to your Galaxy Fold 3. So let's go ahead now and I already have this stuff downloaded. So I'm going to go ahead and bring this up for you guys and show you guys what I'm talking about. So now that you have everything downloaded, let's go ahead and actually go to um, my actual setup. So if I go ahead and go to my folder here and I bring this up, you will see I do have under applications. I have a couple of different applications. I have my Dynu IP update client right there. That's the one I talked about before. I also do have my um, no IP DUC, which is my update client for D no IP. And finally, I do, of course, have my um, well, I have my air message one. Where is that air message one? Uh, should be on here. Okay, I'm not sure why air message not here. Let me go ahead and type it in. Air message. I don't think I uninstalled it. Oh, right, right there. There it is. All right, so now once you go ahead and do this, you install, you got air message installed. You got everything installed. You're going to go ahead and open up your air message. Now, once you go ahead and open up your air message, what you're going to see and you're going to be greeted with right away is going to go ahead and be uh, a message on the side on the top of the screen here. You guys can see it says right here, it shows you server running. Go click on preferences and you're going to see that you have a server port number. My server port number is 1359. Now, everybody's going to have that same server port number. What you're going to have to go ahead and do is go to your Wi Fi settings of your router, go ahead and go on your Wi Fi settings and create a port foldering. Foldering. So, if you guys do not know what that is, you can look it up. But pretty much all you do is you go into your advanced settings of your router, whether you have Comcast or whatever you have, you're going to go and go into your advanced settings. Once you go into your advanced settings, then you're going to go ahead and actually create a port foldering. You're going to forward the port 1359 to a TCP connection, and that's going to let you be able to, through your router, transport the data from your Mac to your full three. So once you go ahead and do that and you have that all done and all worked out, make sure you click on edit password here and make sure you have the correct password you want. So for example, you know, that's my password, obviously create your own password because this is going to be how you connect to this uh, every time you do this. So once you have that all set up, you're going to go ahead and run both your clients, your D, uh, and new IP update client and also your no IP update client. So go ahead and up, go ahead and do that. And let's go ahead and switch back to the Galaxy Fold 3 and take a look at what we're going to do next on the phone. One second, guys. Once you go ahead and go back to your phone, this is the screen you're going to be met with. And you're going to see right away that it does say 
uh, manual configuration. You can click on that. You can go ahead and put it in your server address, your fallback address, and also your password you created on that uh, error message application. So I'm going to go ahead and type in all this. Again, your first message address, right, is your initial dinu.com server address. Your second one is your no IP address. And then obviously your password is the password you use in that uh, error message application. So one second, guys. So you guys see right there, I got a notification that says connected to Ryan's MacBook Pro. So that means I am all good to go. I just click on done. And now all my messages should be synced to this device. So I've click on done. You guys are going to see it says download uh, message history. Uh, you are now connected to Ryan's MacBook. Would you like to copy your messages from the computer to this device? Download messages right there. And it will start downloading all my messages. So guys, that's how you get air message on, oh, sorry, iMessage on your Galaxy Fold 3. Now, I will tell you right now that in order to go and text somebody off of this, even though you are on iMessage, you will go be texting them through your email. So you will not be texting them through your number. Keep that in mind that if you are texting someone through this, they have to text your email to reply to your iMessage. And also, of course, they have to go ahead and you would text them off your email, not your number. So this works for anyone who has an iPhone and you're texting someone who has an iPhone. If they have an Android phone, then obviously it will not work. But at the same time, though, it is very awesome and dope. And I will say, Again, like I said, when I message on Galaxy Fold 3, this is how it works. Thank you guys for watching. 